But. Yep, that's. I, don't, I, I told you. I know, no, I know. You told me, and that's fine, and that's. I'm fine. Fine. Hi. You're happy. Happy. What? What's today? Is it Tuesday? Oh yeah, I gotta put. I gotta put the what trash out tonight. Hi. Happy Tuesday. Um. Yeah, it's Tuesday, and we're doing stuff. Not only are we doing stuff, but we're doing things also, as is tradition around these parts. Um. So I know I didn't put the schedule up until five minutes ago. It's fine. I already told you what I was doing this week. So you already knew, and if you didn't know, why aren't you paying attention? I've told you like 17 times. Yes, Ali Beth stuff and things I saved up for. I, mean, I can't remember what I had for breakfast this morning. I didn't have breakfast, so jokes on you. I went to oh, Wendy's for nobody lunch. Nobody tell Pert. Yeah, mm, she'll be fine. Anyway, um, so all week this week I'm playing Potions of Curious Tale. This was a demo that we covered during Steam Next Fest, but tonight's special because we have a special guest with us. We have Riku Kitty Renee, who is actually the dev and creator of Potions of Curious Tale. Hi, Renee. Hello, honored to be here. I'm I'm honored to have you. Thank you for coming and hanging out with us tonight. I think we're gonna have a really good time. Um, it's gonna be a good one. So, um, oh my. Hello, hi, hidden. Um, but anyway, hello to everyone. Hello, I saw uh, CKYs here and Miss Alibeth and Mags and Hidden and Louie. Hello, hello, everyone. Um, it's good to see you. Okay, we're just basically going to go straight into the game. Uh, let's just screw it. Let's just go over there because game's running. Game that you just lost. Sorry, sorry, I had to say it. Uh -huh. mm. Violence. Why, why do you hate? Why don't you love me? I've done nothing wrong. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's that's your excuse for everything. Can't uh, prove it. Uh-huh. All right. So, here's this is this is fun. So, I launched this uh right before we got started and I saw that there was a load option and I go I go, "Renee, does my demo progress save?" She's like, "It sure does." And we we all were, you know, praising her for her uh forethought on that. We we like and then to we have all that laughed and we celebrated our differences. It's true, we did. And then you know we passed around snacks and had a great time. Yeah. There were no. Say so we went out for ice cream, mm -hmm, snacks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What did you not get snacks? snacks? Oh well, then you showed Didn't... up late. You should have been here on time. You would have gotten I've snacks with me time. and Tom and Renee. Yep. Yeah. They were good snacks. Oh, speaking of snacks, listen, Ali Beth, don't worry about it. It's fine. Uh, oh, well done. Well done, Miss Ellie. Well done. Uh, is my... Let me make sure. Okay, there we go. And then Dragon and Frog came in and ate all your snacks. Listen here, Bobo. Oh, they'll you? do that. They do They do, do that. Um, they uncosmic your brownies and then they leave. <clears throat> yeah, they do. All right, I'm going to go ahead and load up the game. Renee, would you like to tell everybody a little bit about Potions of Curious Tale for, you know, people who haven't seen it before? And, you know, just tell us a little bit about the history with the game, what you... You know your intentions behind it and stuff like that yeah absolutely so potions a curious tale is an adventure crafting game where your wits are your greatest weapons and combat's not always the answer you play as this young witch named luna who has recently discovered her ability to brew magical potions and she can use these potions as spells to solve puzzles, gather rare ingredients from monsters, uh, and yeah, overcome obstacles on her quest to become a potions master. She lives in a world inspired by fairy tales and folklore uh, from around the globe. So there's African folklore, Western nursery rhymes, um, even Islamic legends. Her wit and intellect help her overcome these challenges. And on her journey, it's really like an coming of age story with uh, like a tongue in cheek storyline. So she, she learns lots of things, you know, advice can be deceiving, adults are already right, are always right. You know, ju don't judge a book by its cover. Uh, so this was a passion project of mine. Um, I started it almost 10 years ago. It yeah. was not originally intended to be a commercial project, um, but so many people really liked this sort of alternative approach to combat um, that I, I kept I kept developing it and then kickstarted it and 
uh, have been developing it on the side while working full time in the games industry and until I shipped it on uh, Thursday. So you picked Thursday specifically. Um, so like, tell me a little bit about like why, why Thursday was like such a specifically important date for you to launch this. Yeah, so Thursday was the day before International Women's Day. And as a uh, female game developer, making a game about a girl whose main target audience tends to be women, uh, it felt like a really appropriate celebration of, you know, how far women's representation has come in the games industry and games. And um, one of my hopes is that uh, Potions itself inspires the next generation of girls to follow their dreams. Because I know when I was growing up with video games, I played a ton. I can't even think of the first game I played as a girl character that wasn't an MMO. Maybe Alice? Mm. And I was playing like... Uh, my, fir my first game was Wolfenstein 3D. So that's how long I've been, yes. <laughs> I've been gaming. Oh, yes. <laughs> I love it. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, like, it's, I mean, even characters like, like, I play a lot of Metroid games. Um, like, Metroid's been a, a favorite series of mine for decades. Um, but, you know, it's, when you play the first, the original Metroid game, until you get to the very end, it is, it's not obvious that Samus is a woman. And then, of course, it's, you know, the... The usual thing with uh, with games of that of that era, where it's like, oh well, she's a woman, so we have to put her in some kind of you know skimpy outfit. She has to be like just the, the, the whole shtick, right? And, and yeah. it's just it's it's nice to see that there's there's different stuff, um, you know, there's different and better representation now than there used to be you're absolutely right like there's we've come a long way but we also still have so much further to go yeah absolutely um i think that representation of women in the games industry is now up to 24 percent, but certainly not 50 when about 50 percent of gamers are uh, women right uh Ooh, you did speed up potion throwing a little bit. I've been keeping up with the patch notes. There's <laughs> a turkey. Hi, turkey. What do we got going on up here? Huh. Uh, Miss Ellie, go to bed. Tell Louis to stay in bed. I love you both. Have a wonderful night. Ah. Nice. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm. I'm just kind of having to reacquaint myself. Oh my god, the that's great. The turkey just drops feathers. Oh. oh when you're chasing it. Ah, I love that. That's great. Yeah. So I don't know if you remember the bestiary. Uh, oh, let's see. Can, can I? I don't remember. I don't remember what. Control it's it's on your bar. It's a uh, D pad, right? Oh, oh, I see it down there. Oh my god, have I been pronouncing that word wrong my entire life? Bestiary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Most people say bestiary because it has beasts, but it there's no yes. a. There's and no also a. yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was doing, and that's why I was doing it. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, look, it drops feathers when it's scared. That's I look, mean, who among us? <laughs> that's that's <laughs> fair. That's fair. Uh, do, do, do. Yeah, she rides a broom. Well, she's a witch. I mean, come on. Come on, CKY. Of course she rides a broom. She came down in a bubble. <laughs> <laughs> she came down in a bubble, Doug. <laughs> 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 Uh, and then don't forget you have your quest log if you ever want to know what to do next. Oh, yeah. Everyone loves a log. Everyone does love a log. Oh, boy. Uh, <laughs> nope, no, I didn't mean to throw it. Don't I have... Oh, and it's just on the right side of your screen if that's what you were looking for. That's what I was referring to. Oh, you sure. Don't I have a... Oh, I don't have like a fire fire potion yet. I gotta go figure that out. 
I can collect, well, I can't collect all of my side quests and ignore the main story. Oh my God. I'm a tomato. Oh wait, no, that's something different. That's, that's something different. No, no, no. No, no. Some people really do not like the spiders. I do not like the spiders. <laughs> oh no, I'm. Well, the water's not going to do much, is it? Oh, it, oh, it did. Hey, look at that. Ooh. Yeah, I, I might put in an arachnophobia mode. Um, I'd be your best friend forever. I know. I know a lot of folks around here. Like when we, um, <clears throat> several of us played uh, Satisfactory, and that was. One of the things that we really enjoyed was when they ha added arachnophobia mode and then when they improved recently, they improved it to make it even like more like not spidery, which was no, like, like they literally don't spawn at all. Yeah. Like it's, uh, that's what they did. Yeah. So it's like it's it's gone which from isn't particularly practical in this case, but right. So there's a, a hint I want to give you about this level for a special secret. Ooh, OK. I, I don't know if you noticed, um, but when you came into the zone, the level's name was House of Sticks. Oh, that's really expert hint giving. Like this House of Sticks right here. I need a cauldron, though. I need to make more stuff. Most people, when they say, like, I have a hint for you, they just, like, flat out say the thing they want you to do. <laughs> yeah. Well, see, that's 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 why she's she's a good gamer and dev, because she didn't just flat oh. out tell me. Happy birthday, <gasps> Hidden. I have a oh, happy mm -hmm. birthday. Hidden, it's your birthday. Happy birthday, Hidden. I love you, Hidden. I've, uh, I've mentored people a lot in game development, and I've gotten very used to, like... Oh, it doesn't work in replies, buddy. Oops. Yeah. <laughs> you Go ahead, try it again. No, oh, all right. Wow, that's what you get. That's what you get for your poor attempt. You should be ashamed. <laughs> you should be very ashamed. Oh, hey, look. Uh, okay. I came to a very important conclusion earlier. Yes. Peeps. Peeps, like... You know. Yeah, like peeps. Like marshmallow peeps? Marshmallow peeps. Yeah, 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 yeah. They are the candy corn of the spring. Oh. <laughs> yeah, they are. Ooh. Absolutely. Wow, wow. Have you ever microwaved one? I haven't. I have been present while that occurred. Uh, it went badly. Oh, you can burn them easily, but if you, if you microwave happened. them um, a little bit until they get just slightly melty, and then you pull them apart, they'll harden into the same sort of crunchy marshmallow like um, in Lucky Charms. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, so I almost always microwave my peeps a bit and turn them into crunchy marshmallows because I like oh, that yeah. texture a lot more. See, so what happened in this case was uh, this was a person at an office I was I was working at and they put two on a plate and gave them both toothpick spears and decided that they would battle until only one was still standing. I I've seen that. I've seen that. Yeah, they'll poke each other as they're inflating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. However, it just made a smell. <laughs> Not a good smell. A very bad smell. Oh yeah, I forget I got to use I got this red dye I got to use for stuff. Are you gonna try to make a uh, fire potion as well? Uh, eventually, yeah. But I have I have so little fire components right. Like I only have two ash right now. So ah, yeah. Okay, because you create all those um explosive fire yeah. explosive potions. Ooh, go whoosh. You know what's funny? Uh, the new season of Fortnite just started, and it's all Greek mythology, and one of the goddesses that they added into Fortnite is Artemis. Nice. Yeah, yeah. and then um, <clears throat> they've introduced a new rifle. It's the Huntress DMR. 
which I'm a big fan of the DMRs in Fortnite just because like they go they go pew but with some distance. So, you know, it's kind of like I'm not I'm not good at sniping. I'm terrible at it. That's why, you know, I keep people like Lolly around cuz he's he's much better at that kind of thing. But just, you know, I like the mythology. I'm the stuff. best decoy money can buy. It's boy <laughs> howdy, are you ever? Tom's our decoy potato. We uh we throw his Never corpse at people. Like decoy potato. <laughs> uh, nice. Everyone likes to feel useful. Mm hmm. It's true. Uh, Alright, so here's what I'm gonna do. Let's. let's Ooh, uh, that was good loot. Oh. Okay. We're just gonna head home for this. Nyom. And go whoosh. Also, whoosh. The whoosh is very important. Mm hmm. The whoosh is very important. Yeah, I love this. Uh, there's one thing that I do need to do. I clip his Tom saying, no, don't worry about me. And Lolly was like, don't worry, I'm not. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I thought he was trying to res me. Oh, no. No, he was He was not, in fact, trying so to res me. So that's why you. I was like, hey, no, don't. <laughs> Save yourself. Go on without me. <laughs> oh, and Lolly's like, okay. Tell my wife I love her. I think the good thing was that I think I ended up getting the guy down before you uh, expired. I think you did, yeah. Other classic moments in history. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey, buddy. What you doing? Uh... <laughs> Did you just find Wario? Oh. <laughs> I wasn't looking, I was only listening, and I just heard Wah! <laughs> I thought you found a Wario. I, I was waiting to do that, that specific thing, since the demo, since I got done with the demo, because I I discovered red dye like right as I was finishing up my time with it, and I'm like, I know where I need to go. And then I was like, aha, I'm doing it again. Now I gotta go back and do it. And you're like I have to go. My people need me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wee. Wee. That's a this one that a lot of people uh, don't get for a while. Oh, it's the red a, die with the bowl. One. Yeah. Yeah. Is it an age thing? Like. No, it's it's really interesting watching uh, different people play the game because. Everybody has their own things that they take too quickly or struggle with. I was thinking, like, maybe it's just my generation that learned that bulls attack red, even though that's not really what well, they're after. This guy yeah. here tells you that. Yeah. So, yeah, like, he's you have a conversation. You get, you get prepped for it. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha. Yeah, even Luna's like, uh, hey bud, you're wearing a red shirt. And... Fancy to... Oh yeah, I wasn't here with Helios last time. Yeah, Helios uh, adds a lot of uh, fourth wall breaking commentary. I love it. I love everything about it. And... Helios is very good kitty. Helios is Deadpool. Okay. One of my goals for post-launch here... Mm -hmm. uh, is to to see if I can get Helios plushies made. Oh my god, I would yes. absolutely, yeah, a hundred percent, hundred percent. Do you plan on having other merch at some point? So I I did a Kickstarter and I have to create merch for for them at least. Mm -hmm. Um, so that's going to be T-shirts, an art book, um, and posters, some other things like that. So I'll probably have that available. It's just easier to do in bulk. Nice. Um, what kind of merch do you like? Um, I mean, I'm, I'm a fan of t-shirts as long as they come in, you know, like, like size fat, like, cause I'm, I'm a, I'm a big fella. I'm a, where's the, oh, it's right there. You, look, you, you eat well. Yeah, I, I do. You, I, you enjoy food. I do very I, much. I, I like yeah. food. <gasps> Looks, it's a whale. Oh, love me a whale. 
I've never oh, seen him enjoy food ever. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> I, don't, I don't really believe he does. Lolly's He's my emotional. He's complaining about how much he hates food. Yeah, Lolly's my emotional support Italian um, because Tom's no longer local. So Lolly will go to places <laughs> with me to eat things that, you know, my wife being she isn't typically into. So, like, she, he'll go with me to Denny's and stuff like that because she has a tummy that is has more discerning tastes. And I like That's to a eat, nice way to put it. And I like to eat garbage. Uh, yeah. Sometimes I like literally. good garbage. So I think that's like the difference. Good garbage is amazing. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's fair. Good garbage. Oh my you, god. Do you live in an area that has access to sheets. To what? Uh, that's going to be a note. Oh. Uh, it's, uh, it's gas station fast food. It is the definition of good garbage to me yeah they've got ah. these mac and cheese bites that i would love to just get shoved at my face like all the time shoved at my face is what i said i mean oh. of course everyone would love carbs and fat and more carbs and fat mm. mac and cheese bites are great yeah i i love i love lots of carbs and fat and i am being summoned it's true <clears throat> and now the wisdom of the girls this is one of my favorite bits well don't get too attached to it we're <laughs> I know from a chapter entitled encourage others Blanche now look you have to discover the sensuality of baseball there's there are just many 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 similarities between baseball and making love the mental preparation, the rush of adrenaline, the unspecified duration of the game. Sophia, you should hear the cheers coming from Blanche's room on Old Timer's Day. Jesus Christ. And this has been the wisdom of the girls. Thank you for being a friend. Fantastic. So, Renee, to give you some backstory, uh, Tom had received a book as a gift a while back. Um, what was the exact name of the Skeletor book, Tom? Oh, hang on. That one's over here on the old shelferino. Yeah. Where is it? Oh, yeah, there it is. It's called What Would Skeletor Do? Yes. Diabolical Ways to Master the Universe. So Skeletor is Tom's favorite fictional character of all time. Um, so oh, what? He's my favorite 80s cartoon villain of all time. <laughs> anyway. Um, <clears throat> so Green Ranger. Okay, all right. I guess I'll give you that one. Um, but... So he received this book as a gift uh, from one of our community members. And so for a while he was doing, uh, you know, Skeletor Wisdom. And then he, what was it, your sister found this book? Uh, no, 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 no. Miss Allie Beth. Oh, Allie Beth found it? Um, mm -hmm. So uh, his wife, Allie Beth, found this book um, uh, that is just a collection of Golden Girls quotes. And obviously like illustrations and stuff like that. But, you know. We, we get the quotes here because, you know, Tom doesn't have the, can't share the visual. So that's, it's one of my favorite bits is when Tom gets to impart wisdom from the girls. And I still watch the Golden Girls every night at bed. All right, Rumpelstiltskin. If you can guess my name. Tom Ritten. <laughs> Imps are notorious for singing their own praises in private. If we find where he celebrates, we might discover his name. Camp in some remote part of a forest. They might have seen something in the twisted woods. Hmm. Hint, hint, hint. Hmm. Yeah. What else we got around here? Go up here. The sauce. The sauce may be coming back soon. I can neither confirm nor deny oh, the imminent oh. return of the sauce. Oh, oh. Hi, Liz. Oh, uh, Liz is... Liz is apparently falling through the looking glass. There's a rest of the... So apparently Granny is big shit in this town. Like... Everybody knows her, and most people like her. And the people who don't like her, well, frankly, wrong. can go fuck themselves. 
I think it's a small enough town that everybody knows everybody, but yeah. Granny is still the shit. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, oh no. Uh, this could be to my benefit. Do I hear a kitten's cat? Oh, I hear a kitten's cat. Oh, there she goes. What? Oh. He has wandered off into the, the cozy spot to be cozy with Bean. Is she? Is she? Is she being very feisty, cat? Oh, good. Oh, good. Uh, we have a kitty named Loaf. She is uh, a little over three years old, and she's a tiny, precious angel baby. And also very silly, and also very snuggly. <gasps> Did the colors not work? Maybe I have to redo the light. Lights back in. And that plug is in, for some reason, that plug was installed upside down. We'll fix it. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, thanks. Oh, thanks. Where? Let me go fix this real quick. Wait, Beautiful. what happened? There we go. Okay. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I tabbed out. I had to oh. fix the I had to fix the colors so that Kitty got her color. Hi, Kitty. How are oh. you, Kitty? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Well. You, you are late tired. By the well, way, have a nap. <laughs> then fires the missiles. missiles. <laughs> uh, by the way, Renee, love the like the little tiny jingle on as you're flying around on the broom. Lovely touch. Thank you. Yeah, it's a good. It's a better flying sound than just pure whooshing. <laughs> yeah, for sure. For sure. I like to imagine there's tiny little bills on the bristles. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Maybe her little moon on there works like a uh, wind chime. Ooh, I like that. Because it's, it's a it's a moon, and I don't know if you can see there's a little star in the center. Oh, yeah. Ooh, so it's right. Hey, little bug. Isn't it so appropriate that uh, it's Luna and Helios, mm. sun and moon? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I love it. I love it. So much. You, sh you should go talk to that that guy. Okay, let me pick all of my berries because I'm I'm running low on bloobs. Get some bloobs. So yeah, what's it like to watch somebody play your labor of love? Um, it's much better now. Well, you know, in, in the first times watching people play, there wasn't uh, there was definitely more polish that needed to be done, and so it felt like <laughs> felt kind of bad, honestly. No. Oh, you already got the quest from him. Sorry. I did. I did. I no, that. you're fine. You're fine. Uh, ow. Ow. Dang it. Listen, it's it's okay. an RPG. Just you never know what... Shit hogs. Oh, nice. It's definitely, when I watch it, it doesn't feel like I'm just watching somebody play a game. Like, I am judging every single reaction and things that are missed and things that are not missed and thinking if there are any changes I, I should make. I've actually been um, making a lot of minor changes today just to help people uh, like camera focus when you get to an area that requires you to do something special that might not be obvious, ah. things like that. I didn't, I hit my trigger accidentally. Yeah, uh, so let me ask you, being a developer that obviously you've been doing this for quite a while now, uh, are you, are you a uh, painful per perfectionist and like almost immediately hate once you create something and want to redo it, or are you normal? Um, I'm. <laughs> or are you normal? <laughs> yeah. So I I'm a recovering perfectionist. Fair. I would say. Ooh. Yeah. So I I definitely was the kid who would cry if I got like a ninety five on a test. Um, when I was growing up, mm -hmm. so that was pretty yep, bad. Yep, yep, yep. Very stressful way to live. Do not recommend. Mm. 
Um, then I went to a really, really, really difficult top tier school. Mm -hmm. Um, and I just had perfectionism beaten out of me for the most part. That's fair. It, it still tries to creep in on some things. Like, um, I'm really bad at, uh, doing art with, um, paper and pencil. Cause I will try to erase too much and redo and erase and redo until I just like muddy up the paper and make it all ugly. Mm. Uh, so I, I instead do watercolor cause, cause I have to commit. But with um, a game this large and with so many decisions and so much different uh, player experiences and opinion, I guess I don't feel like I've been too perfectionist. Um, but I definitely try to add in those extra little touches that make it feel good. That's fair. Hey. Renee, was that on purpose? <laughs> is, th is this on purpose? Yeah, <laughs> yeah it is. <laughs> I love it. It's the oh, fairy no. forest. No, You're in the just fairy felt forest. Compelled. <laughs> oh, well done. Oh, just mwah, beautiful. Oh, almost. That means there must be something even better. So, okay, there is like this whole. Like there's, there's just, we have memes galore around here, and one of the memes is that the GG command in my chat, it plays a random like Final Fantasy like battle win sound, um, but there's one in particular that it will play. It's like the extended version from Final Fantasy 14 when you've like completed like the end of a storyline. Um, and so, right, yeah, I've, I've played Final Fantasy XIV. I'm familiar with that one. Yeah, so like it's it, it's like the one that just played, but with like the additional trailing music at the end. And so like we, uh, whenever we something really great happens, someone will use the GG, and invariably the bot knows because it's it's completely random. But the bot knows when to play the good one because that's the good one. I just nice. It's nice. great. Oh, that's oh, oh no 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 licky no licky no licky yes, no no more licky no no additional licky. Ah. So the dart frogs are poisonous. <laughs> I yep, as you know honestly as oh god, as I would expect them to be. Uh, Kitty, why are you moving but into the gym? What What is going on? The game definitely on? like ramps up in terms of threats. It, I think it's, I'd like to think it's a good pacing. Um, mm -hmm, but mm -hmm. yeah, as you get into la la later levels, there's definitely more threats. As you saw with the spiders, right? Yeah. Uh, okay, so here's what I need. I need... Stop that. If you go south, I think you'll find ah. some interesting stuff. Oh, I'm okay, I gotta I gotta get all kinds of stuff. Uh I might have to head back home. Hmm. Ooh. Oh god. No frog. You might as well just move in. That's fair, kitty. That's fair. So something that uh, most people don't actually notice is that the cauldrons will also heal you to full life. Not just going home. Secret hack trick. <laughs> I did you're right, I didn't notice that. Yeah, it's not in the tutorial or anything. You just have to be observant. <laughs> Dentists hate him. Oh, wait. No, that's something different. <laughs> this one weird trick. <laughs> nice. You know, you're trying to get a bit more in shape for Japan. That's fair. That's fair. Kitty, how's that going, by the way? How's, like, your whole, like, J preparing for Japan trip going? Ah, uh, let's see. Are you just visiting Japan or are you moving there? She's just visiting. Ah, cool. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm also happy to answer questions about Japan. I've been four times. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, I would like to 
I would like to go to Japan at some point. It it's great. It's my favorite place to travel, so that's why I've, I've been there so so much. What do you think that is? I mean, it looks like it might be a giant block of ice. All right. Helios is fine. Yeah, Helios is really OP. He doesn't care about anything. That's fair. Just about complaining and treats. Those are like... His, his, so his like a regular cat. Like, so he, yeah. <laughs> so he's a cat, but, you know, can talk. <laughs> yep. Ooh. Oh, nice. Hold on, women. If you hear a booming roar, you might be on the menu. Ooh. That's as, true. As with Australia everything else in Australia, dead. something yeah. else is trying to kill you. <laughs> it's been two weeks traveling. So, Ooh. fun game industry fact. Mm -hmm. uh, facts, I guess, about Kyoto. Uh, first of all, that's where Nintendo is headquartered. Mm -hmm, so, mm -hmm, there's mm -hmm. some cool Nintendo stuff there. And... There's actually a really, really large indie game community in Kyoto. In fact, it's probably the largest uh, indie game community in Japan. So in July, they always host Bit Summit, which is the only like indie game con uh, convention, large indie game convention in Japan. I've been I've been down through Okinawa. Oh, on the last trip I was, I uh, I took a cruise, so I went down the south of Japan from Tokyo all the way down through the Okinawan Islands. That sounds fun. That was actually it was my parents' fortieth anniversary, uh, so they went on a cruise, and my dad had previously been stationed in Okinawa during the um, Vietnam War. Oh wow! Yeah. It, it is very different today than it was back then. I, yeah, I imagine so. All right, let's make a bunch of healing potions just in case I need them. Wow, that is a bunch of healing potions. <laughs> Listen, you never he's, know. He's very bad at games, so I'm, this works out. I'm, I'm very <laughs> Ooh, bad at games. Harsh. Damage is no, no. magnetically attracted to his face. No, no. No, no, they're not wrong. <laughs> Get rocked, frog. Yeah. Ooh, an amphibian eye. He popped his eyeball out. I did pop his eyeball out. Well, that's what he well, gets for being in a frog in, that tried to attack me. Yeah. That wasn't cool. Yeah. Okay. Oh, heck. Huh. Oh, hey, look! I, I accidentally a thing. <laughs> I love when that happens. It's actually really fun trying to set up the uh, accidentally a thing things, because there's a lot to discover, so it's uh helps to help the player a little bit with that. You, you, got, you gotta you get. Get interact with the vines to climb them. Well, I'm I'm tr I'm trying to see if I can get the water to to aim at the, the frog, but it's hard. The frog this. is immune to water, so he got oh. hit. Oh. Um, ooh, we might use those healing potions. Yeah, I can. I could always. See, we cheat. tried to tell you. I have, <laughs> I have. I have. I've, I've heard. I've heard from recent developers in my area that uh, if I use the cauldron, it'll heal me. Oh hey. <laughs> The I think frogs you just think that water. you're, this helps. Oh, thanks, you're built like a tank and not a uh, twelve-year-old witch. That's yeah, that's fair. I do like these rock bombs. They're pretty nice. Badoosh! Look at that pun. Eye-opening experience. Mm -hmm. Oh, Tay's Tay's notorious for his punnery around here. Oh, it's too bad he can't see all the um, achievements. All the achievements are puns in this game. Well, let's see. Uh, let's go see what I've gotten so far. Um, I've gotten Beginner's Brew, Pet the Darn Cat, 
Scene Red, Sweep Speed, and Squid Pro Quo. That's a good one. I like that one. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Snortworthy. Great. An 18 hour thing? That's several hours. I forgot. I have to spread democracy. Oh yeah, you gotta do that. I'm doing well, my new, part. A new thing started. I need to do fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> new Helldivers update? Or... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And then also a new major order. We're getting rid of them damn bugs. Yeah, forever. And, and my personal order involves automatons, so I'm not... Uh, Helping Fantastic. with that right now. <laughs> Too bad yeah. they don't make automaton bugs. I'm sure they do. I need more watery, water, watery medus. Democracy, democracy, coming to a bug near you. Hmm. The song I wrote about democracy. Please don't shoot rockets at me. I'm not rocket proof. Uh, hello game. Why are you doing this? 1 a.m. comes awfully early. Boy, howdy, does it ever. Boy, howdy, does 1 a.m. come early. That's that's in that's entirely too many. There we go. DKY, go get go sleeps, buddy. I love you. It is almost it is almost one AM for you, yeah, that's true. Hey, I don't know if you know this, but the frogs are poisonous. So you know, like don't touch them. They're also immune to water. Oh hey, look! Oh my god, it's a tanuki! Speaking of Japan, you'll right? see them all over. I love it. Don't transform into something watch if you can't play the part. Yeah. Hey, watch out for Italian plumbers. Just, just say it. Hi, Viv. Viv is the, uh, he's the third mod on my mod team. Hi Viv, He's we're having Italian. we're having lots of fun. Yeah, I, I I apparently my I just keep collecting Italians. I don't know what's going on. Ah, uh, Viv's a duck. He's also Italian though. Don't be so catty, feline. I'm just giving you a free lift, thinking I fell asleep. Oh. Well, I wouldn't say. Okay, well, listen. I wouldn't say I'm a potions master, but I can see where you would make that mistake. Ooh. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, let's let's friggin' go. What if you lick them? Um maybe, but you know, I don't I I'm I might just pass on that. How come none of my friends show up on my friends list? Uh, I'm allegedly offline. So, I don't know what's going on. Oh. Okay, well this is fair, perhaps. So... Ooh, Steam. silver card. <gasps> Ooh. Perhaps none of my friends are currently playing, let's see. He's old, nope, he's ugly, I have he's a grumpy. I have a friend playing. Tom, you're two of those things. What? It says it's it's Karen. He's he's oh. old, he's ugly, and he's grumpy. You're you're two of those things. But you're a cutie patootie. Not that old. I don't know. You're how old are you now, Ma? About two hundred. <laughs> Give or take. <laughs> 
Mushroom mashup mystery. Neom. Neom. Your Steam friends not show up on the social tab? I'm gonna come back to that cave. I love me a cave. It's because I'm a bear, you see. I've heard this about you. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Oop. Is that the one? Yeah, it is. Yes. Ha <laughs> ha No, no. Okay. Uh huh. Frog didn't touch me. Bye, frog. My god. There's frogs every. Oh god. Oh god. Ow. Hey, don't let the frogs touch you. <laughs> There's a life lesson in there somewhere. Do, 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 do. Oh, just my. Because we know Krakow. God. Renee, I don't know if you know this, but there's you left some slicey majigs down here. <laughs> the number of people who try to go against the blades is really amusing. What? <laughs> you can do it, but it it's way harder. Now I now I kind of do it. <laughs> ah. See, this is why you can't trust frogs. This right here. Well, that among many other reasons. Yeah. Coming message from Super Earth. Oh no, I, I don't know if I can do it in that direction. So, uh, the bounce off of the bug. Ow! I mean, uh, yeah, I guess you can do it in the other direction, but it hurts. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh. right, what do we got in here? His eyes. Ooh, those eyes are worth two. Good boy. Oh, the vines. Mm. Ooh, I can make a couple of those. I can do a couple of those. <clears throat> hmm. Oh, yeah, let's see if it'll let me join anyone. Tell you, stop that. How many times have I told you to stop saying those things? How dare you? How dare you? <clears throat> okay, so Renee, tell us a little bit about the artwork because I know, I know you did the dev. You know, this is your concept, and you did the dev. But you had, you know, a few other people helping you out with some of like the music and artwork and stuff. So, tell us a little bit about that. Yeah. Um, so I started this game initially as more of a portfolio piece. In the games industry, it's really important to have provable pieces of your work. And uh, especially early on in your career, one of the best ways to do that is to create small games on the side, either um, by just working them on yourself, even doing tutorials, and then uh, potentially doing game jams. Uh, so I wanted to see if I could enjoy designing a game. So mm -hmm. I came up with the concept for potions. Um, and then I decided to, to build out a rough prototype in, in Unity. Uh, and then I just never stopped. I just kept, <laughs> kept going. Um, when I told people what I was working on, they seemed really excited about it. Uh, so I, I kept working on it. Uh, I kickstarted it, which gave me some funds to hire for art and audio and such. And then um, it, those funds were certainly not enough for me to pay myself at all or work full time on it because, you know, food and rent is important mm -hmm, mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. i instead got full-time gigs within the games industry contract gigs as well and worked those while working on potions on the side nice uh so in terms of my roles on the project uh i do i've done about 95 percent of the code i've gotten some help with like controller support um and some localization support uh I've done most of the design, um, but had some help with the final two temples in particular, and, and uh, like the final two zones. Mm -hmm. um, and then the only art that's in the game of mine is the, the soot sprite, actually. Oh, nice. Uh, and some of the icons, so. Nice. But in terms of implementing art audio and all of that, I'm, I'm at least the one sticking it in there, so. Nice. But yeah, I, you know, working on a game for almost 10 years means that you've had 
I've had a lot of people come and leave the project. So overall, um, crediting everyone who's contributed anything to, to the game itself, I've had 19 different people contribute. Yeah, I and, saw and that's why you'll sometimes find some inconsistencies in, in like art approach and such. Yeah, well, that makes sense though. I mean, again, it's you've been working on this project for literally 10 years, so. Yep. And I'm still working on it. <laughs> right. A bunch of uh, patch patches to go in right now. I'm in a loading screen. This is training manual tips. Did you know tips are shown during these transition sequences? Hey, did you know? Did you know that tips are shown during the the, the sequences? I've recently been made aware. Oh, okay, good. Hey, hey. Strawberry crumble cake with a, oh, oh Liz, that sounds delicious. That sounds really good. Oh my god, I was we were just talking. Me and Bean were just talking yesterday about how much I love cheesecake. What is your favorite type of cheesecake? Um, so I I feel like I can never go wrong with like a good traditional, um, but like my god, chocolate cheesecake. Oh my god, a chocolate cheesecake. Ow. I think I really like the fruity ones myself. Did I just unlock... Did... Oh, great. What do we do? Helped us. Thanks. Bye. Uh, listen. Listen, fairy... No offense, but some offense. I don't fucking trust you. That's rough. I mean, in my defense, did you see, like, some dark entity just leave this thing out of this giant Sailor Moon locket? No. Oh, well, that, that happened. That didn't. No, it didn't. It did. I, I seen it. I'm pretty sure you made that up. Never trust the Fae. Yeah, that's that was my first mistake. A peanut butter flaps jack. Ooh. Super concentrated chocolate nest quick, just like Lolly likes it. What is happening here? Uh Silver ore, holy shit. Will you stay still and let me democratize you? And rock salt. Not to be confused with rock lobsters. Mine mineral with countless uses, including flavor enhancement. Mmm. I, uh... Nation sleep, bound by promises we keep, and shadows grip secret sealed, only to the worthy revealed. Beware the heart that treads in fright for darkness, there's an absence of light, guarders. Or if you fail to learn. Listen, that... Uh, listen, all I'm saying is maybe I shouldn't have opened this. Is all I'm saying. That seems like it was what you might call a bad idea. Those are the best kind. No, those are the bad kind, Tom. That's that's why it's a bad idea. But it gives you a story to play. Okay, I guess I I, I give you that. I guess. Did I learned nothing from Pandora. I've learned I have learned nothing ever. 
I will have you know. A fern gully? Oh, don't, no, don't do that to me. No, no, I would never pull a fern gully. I mean, maybe. Hey, a new potion. What is it? A minor cone of sand. Bless you. Pocket sand. Oh, <laughs> this shotgun's pretty good. I like pocket sand. Which one? I'll tell you when I'm not fighting for my life. <laughs> so never. Yeah. Oh. The so, first, the first one you unlock. Ah, yes, it is good. I, I fear, I fear, I have to pop off here. Oh. I know, I know, but it's been really lovely. It's been so fun. It has been great. Um, Renee, thanks for coming to hang out with us. I really appreciate it. The game is fantastic. Um, let me go throw a link in chat because I I forgot to do that earlier. Oh, you guys look large. Um, Thank you. So if you haven't picked it up yet, Potions of Curious Tale came out on Steam last week. Um, here in the states, it's currently sixteen ninety nine. Um, how long is that? Uh, the the core gameplay is just around. Like 10, 10 to fifteen hours, depending mm -hmm. on how fast you are. Yeah, um, I would say about about ten, eleven hours um, to finish the core game, and then maybe thirteen to fifteen hours to one hundred percent it, uh, depending oh, nice. on if you get stuck on any puzzles. Nice. Um, yeah. So we're gonna be we're gonna be playing this the rest of the week. Um, <clears throat> uh, thank you again for coming to hang out. Thank you for the key, so I could you know share it with everybody uh... and, and talk about it. Uh, I really, really appreciate it. Um, yeah, this is, was, this is great. And, uh, one, I'm looking forward to the next thing that you make. And two, I want to help with it. I'm not kidding. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Noted. Um, but yes, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Renee. I really appreciate it. Yeah, it's been my pleasure. Thank you so much for having me. And thanks for checking out potions. Absolutely. Um, for everyone, if anyone does pick it up, um, reviews are super helpful. If you do end up playing it, mm -hmm, I've gotten mm -hmm. some, um, negative attention recently online so there's some uh some some less positive reviews more about me than about the game so yeah it'd be great oh. to counteract those internet never change because good, you can't yeah good news they can't yeah uh, all right thank you so much i hope you all have a wonderful night thanks you, you too. too bye renee bye. bye well she's a delight <laughs> Oh, because it's got the characteristics of both. I see. Oh, God. I see. Ooh. An ice spear. That's true. That's true, Kitty. You're not wrong. Furiously magical water. Dun, 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 as soon as she leaves, you two start, are going to start acting like idiots, aren't you? I didn't do anything. I was humming a song. You're not biased or anything? Well, I mean, why would you be? Ooh. A bunch of these. I mean, I love these. Good lord! <laughs> this, <laughs> I'm on easy! Why? <laughs> oh, because fuck you, that's why. Well, part of the problem is I couldn't join anyone, so I'm having to play by myself. Oh. I can't figure out why this game won't let me join people. Uh, um, is it because you touch yourself at night? I had to completely restart Steam, and then I had random-ass people just start joining me. Yeah, but like, no time I have played this have I ever been able to get anyone to or to join anyone's game. The, the only time I get to play with other people is if I quick play. But like, I can't join people who are like on the world map and then no one ever joins me. Enchanted Nectar? Really 
fears of politics and wolves. Gain. Okay. Uh, it helps them. Water can wash off some of its enchanted nectar. Matchmaking set to public, so I don't understand. Ow. Yeah, get rocked, fairy. Oh. That doesn't do anything. Yeah, I keep thinking about going back to Palea. Um, I don't know, I just... I, I don't have the time. I'm gonna wait for a full 1.0. That's fair. A lot Go of uh, irons in the fire here. That's fair. That's fair. I have a lot of cards now. Oh, that's bad. Steam says I have no connection. Oh. Yeah, I had to completely restart Steam in order to fix that. Well, that's what I just did, and now it says I have no connection. <laughs> Do it again. Pretty cool. Pretty happy about this. Can I unequip from here? Oh, okay. There it goes. Just taking its sweet ass time. Maybe I should put my healing potion down at the end here. I'm almost done with my mission. I can drop in and get killed with you. Oh, hey, Thunderscore is playing Potions, A Curious Tale. Thanks for letting me know, Steam. Hey, I don't know if you knew this, but I'm playing Potions, A Curious Tale. I hope this helps. Uh, what's wrong? That's really a, a Harpy Talon? All right. Fairies, okay. Time. My god, you can pet the cat. And he well, purrs. It's <laughs> God. You were just we were all just here for an hour with Renee. You think Same. she would actually put a game on the market where you couldn't pet the cat? I mean, no, but, like... Hey, we just established she is not an amateur. No, yeah. I know. Nyom. Nyom. Ooh. Shrooms. Oh, yeah. I love some shroomans. reload this. Hey, uh, Tom, did you know that you just started playing Helldivers 2? No, I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> I opened it. 
That's way different than playing it. That's fair. The first part of the game is actually getting into a game. Noom. Gobble gobble. Ah. Hey, buddy. Also, getting the game to load in full screen? What? Oh god. Oh god. What is happening? Okay. Now we're in full screen, so I've got that going for me, which is nice. Ah, ah. Yeah, this isn't good. Active. Helldiver's active, unavailable. Enemies killed, unavailable. Like... And puff, I oh, threw it. was you. That was me. Magic feathers with healing powers. Man, I love healing powers. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's letting me join someone. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. first got started tonight um renee was a little distracted before we like actually went live hi ever i love you uh renee was a little distracted before we went live because uh felicia day was actually playing this game on her stream which is pretty fucking cool also she was starstruck by being near me it's true i mean who wouldn't be honestly Damn it, did oh, I run hey. out of fucking fire potions again? The Felicia Day was playing her game on her stream, yes. Yeah. Yeah, the Felicia Day. Yeah, imagine. Oh, there's a spider's den. Oh, this is lovely. Nope, I don't think that I will. Did I hit myself? Whoops! <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, okay. I just run right the spider's in now. Yeah, listen, uh, it's fine. Yeah, she she did she did talk before you got here, Kitty. She did talk about um, a couple of folks have asked her about an arachnophobia mode, to which we were very much yes. Um, it's just tough because it's you can see it's sort of an intrinsic part of the game. But she is she is absolutely that's something that she is considering. Let's head home. Oh, this is so much better with other people. 
which is a sentence I never thought I would wow. say. Wow, I was about to say, that's... Boy, that's a sentence that Tom's never said in his life. Because by yourself, you're just getting your shit stomped in constantly. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, the game does not balance it at all for you to... The, the gameplay balance for if you're playing by yourself is to just do a lower difficulty. Ooh. And even then, you still got to be careful. There we go. Gotta get them bloobs. Nice, kitty, nice. Yeah, um... Renee had a very discouraging day uh, end of last week because she released her game and then uh, she started to hit, like, the new and trending on Steam. And then EA's like, what if we re-release a shit ton of old Command and Conquers and shit? And uh, it bumped her off of the... Uh, it bumped her off the list because... Well, that's... fucking the way it goes. And so she was discouraged and... Got some just horribly nasty comments from people about it, and well, frankly, they can go fuck themselves. But the yeah. business end of a pineapple. Yeah, yeah. So, but it's like playing this game. It's it's apparent that she put a lot of effort and a lot of energy into this. Um, come here, idiot rat. <laughs> Stupid rat. Um, and I was, I was very, uh, fortunate enough. I talked to her about it and able to get a key so again thank you renee for the key thank you for coming by tonight and hanging out All with right. us for a while like this was this is great this is this is just nice you know it's just nice yeah like at least you know the spiders will be there which is good you know to have the forewarning I can cancel. Oh, nice, nice, nice. There's okay. two. Two's over there. But yeah, this is just like a... It's just... It's just chill and peaceful and... Like, there's little puzzles and I get to throw things at shit and occasionally set things on fire, which I'm really... I'm digging. Can't buy any games anytime soon. Well, you have a trip to save up for. That's different. You have a very big, very fun trip that you're going to go on. You're going to gallivant all over Japan. Mm -hmm. And honestly, I'm a little jelly. Here's the thing. Just put it on your wish list. Mm -hmm. When you can buy it, buy it. There you go. That way you remember it. Hey, and by the time you get to a point where, you know, you are able to buy it, maybe it'll have a uh, uh, arachnophobia mode. And you can, uh, you know, deal with the spiders in a different way. They'll be not spiders. I'm getting, I'm, I'm using like, uh, Steam a little more these days. Um, I mean, cause, you know, so many of my friends play stuff on Steam, so it's, it's. I'd say over the last year and a half or so, there's been a uh, a giant shift for me from console to PC. Boys, guys, we're under attack over here. <laughs> I know none of you can hear me because what even is voice chat? But what's a voice chat? Hmm. 
Even though they tend to buy a lot of things from it. We'll see. There you go. Well, see, don't think of it as your friends buying things off of your wish list for you, Kitty. Think of it as your friends helping to contribute to your Japan trip in an indirect way. Because the money that you would be spending on games, they're spending it for you. And you can use that money instead to save up for your trip. That makes sense, right? I'm pretty sure it makes sense. No! Oh, I was just friendly fired. Oh. That one's kind of... That's kind of my own fault, honestly. Well, <laughs> well you know, this, sh this shit happens. <laughs> we, were, Hi, we were in the shit together. You got the way of democracy. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's no friendly fire in this game. Ooh, got me a new bronze card. Ah, uh, it's a Grindelo. Oh, good. She picks up the sample. Nice. Off we go, then. Oh. Being as the Grindelos. Uh, that way. What a oh, Tom's Tom's not much of a hugger. I can be persuaded. Well, if you if you bribe him with potatoes, he will hug you for potatoes. Wait, requesting orbital. We're not even under attack. What are you doing? I'm literally getting paid. What are you doing? Bombing a base, maybe? Huh. Listen, you know, Kitty, don't question it. You're, listen, you're, you're getting, you're getting paid to do the thing that you were going to do anyway, so, fuck yeah. What a slap on the ass. Oh, no, that's reserved for me, and I guess also Alibeth, but mostly me. Yeah, I don't know what they're doing. <clears throat> Are you on a full squad? I am now, yeah. But uh, two of them are just fucking around and requesting orbital strikes, and I don't really understand why. And you start work after Easter? Ooh, nice. Nice, kitty. That'll be good. Oh, yeah, no. No one no one touches my ass. Not even being... Uh, it was in our vowels. Not without gloves. Just a little something. Hey, you know what? Every little bit helps. Damn. Thought I could get more ash that way. Four hours a week for 15 bucks an hour. I said ash, not ass, you pervert. <laughs> Listen, Check kitty. Over here for it's, samples. It's better than nothing, right? You need to save for Japan. There you go. There you go. Truly love that for you. Oh, do I have to... Oh... Now you understand? Oh, now I understand. Japan, you're gonna eat so much food? Yes! I wanna see pictures of everything that you eat. Oh, man! Come on! <laughs> Son of a bitch! First it's frogs, then it's actually Cracko! Ugh! Post lots and lots of pics. Yeah. Hell yeah, we did it. <laughs> Gonna be filming available. In a vlog or two. Ooh, that should be good. 
Is there a trench coat? Do we need to release the Kraken? No, we need to put him in like a box somewhere so we can keep up with him. Oh boy. All right, I need to go to this cave. Where did he die? There we... Oh. Oh, that was a direct hit. Oops. Well, whatever. I don't know how much the arc thrower is going to cost, but I'm going to save my pennies to make sure I can buy it in the level. Do, 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 do. Yeah, fuck you, ice blocks. Ooh, nice. Fairy dust. Ooh. Ooh, toxic shell fragments. He shards with. Then poisons. Ooh. Come on, guys, get the fuck on the shuttle. No. Them. One guy just dove out of the shovel. <laughs> sure. I can't tell if he meant to or not. I think he was trying to dive into it to be cool. Didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> when you're done there, I can, uh, I'm not in a mission yet, so I can... I'll, I'll go back in. to my, my ship here in a second. Yeah. Outstanding patriotism. Well done. Eight samples. Hey, not bad. Eight oh samples. my god. god. Oh, I killed it. Oh. Yes, it deserved to die, and I hope it rots in hell. The tiny cabin. Yeah, I need to... I That is something I need to work on also, is my house. Oh, I had the best accuracy. Bean, did you get attacked by a loaf? And the most samples. And the least amount of friendly fire. I think Bean got attacked by a loaf. And the feisty cat was. Wonder being if someone feisty. dropped, oh. or if I just kicked someone out to join your ship. I don't know. You just came in. This isn't my ship. Uh oh. I was about to go back to it, and now you've showed up here. Oh well. I can rejoin you once you go back to your ship. Okay, because these people are useless. <laughs> Oh, yeah, uh, he's impervious, so... Love that for him. There we are. For him, not so much for me. I'm receiving data. 
Wait, wait. Receive that data. I got some data you can receive. <laughs> well, he is fully functional. Oh my god! I understood that reference. <laughs> uh. What is this? Oh, that's one other one. Oh, hey, it's you. Hi. Hello. Oh, that's a big cave. Oh, that's a cave. That's like the cave of Kyrbanug. There. <laughs> it's loading and it says, please wait democratically. Nice. <laughs> I found a bunch of stuff. The medium sized kit. I don't even have another room. Like I have, I have a single and room. Bye, cave snake. Ooh, a snake fang. Ooh. I like that cape. We'll wear it. They... The f element we use in this universe, I guess, to fuel these ships is made from the bug body, like, bug corpses so we well, are just are we making more fuel <laughs> well then why are we trying to stop them so are we supposed to start our own or are we supposed to join someone in progress also what difficulty should we be on here um, I don't know the exact range but I would assume with you level 4 probably somewhere between 1 and 3 yeah I only have up to 3 unlocked yeah I'll take three. Anyhow, should we start? Should we find somebody that's already going? Uh, if you want to. That's what I use my tent for, kitty. Eradicate swarm. Or activate control system. No parts when kill. This whole impact causes to drop a snake. Activate control system sounds really hard. Rocks and vines. I had to do one for activating batteries earlier, and oh boy. Yeah, that's the same one. Blitz, search and destroy. And there's a swarm. Let's just kill them. It should take you with me, right? Yes. Okay. Failed to join. Session is full. Oh, yeah, that's this what I... What it, this is what it does to me. I kept my tent just for that. I don't want to fight chargers. I'm not ready for that. I might not have a choice. Huh? Huh? Hey! Hold on back here. You didn't come with me. Yeah, I did. Oh, it doesn't show you oh. here for some. That's a bay windows of the main house for flood rise. Ooh, nice. I love some good bay windows. Up, oh, up, oh, here he comes. Here Arian. he comes. <laughs> We're going to party with Harry S. Truman. Yep. Well, I mean, if you're going to do it democratically. For great democracy. Uh, We're doing bugs, right? Yes. All right. Uh... I'm going to bring. Is if orbitals covered, so I'm gonna bring napalm. Yeah, basically because we don't, that's all I we have. Don't care about war crimes. No. No, they're encouraged. Oh. Love a good war crime. For great democracy or whatever. Did you know that bugs can't even vote? Wow. It's cause it's cause like the the little bubbles on the the ballots are so tiny and they got those big old claws you see. More like Geneva suggestions. <laughs> <laughs> uh 
I found a sample. I feel like the guy that was just standing in front of my turret might not want to move. Oh, that might have been you, Tom, actually. <laughs> I wasn't standing in front of it. I was to the side. That. We're Newman boys, we're Newman. Hello, Newman. Hello, Jerry. You should go to bed. Yeah, you should. It's a little late for you there, pal. Hey, I would go to bed if I were you. Mm-hmm. Tom would go to bed even if he wasn't you. He would just he just loves to go into bed. It's it's a top activity, for sure. Oh, here they come. Oh. Bug breach. Where? Oh, there I see it. Oh, that's a beefy boy. Oh, I got Not it. anymore. <laughs> hey, I opened a big door. I don't know if you saw that, but there was a big door. Hey, that's great door opening. Thanks. Your best is there at noon, or birth is on the ninth. You got our massive... Aww. Look at you being a good friend, kitty. What happens when I do this? A greater lava potion? Oh... Oh, I like that. Wait a minute. I want to get out of these. A water spear? Ooh. What's going on in here? Ooh, it's a card. The green man. Oh no, I'm stuck. Oh, you should not. I can't move. There we go, uh, I got it. I was able to dive. <laughs> Help me, Step Lolly. <laughs> of course, it's a purple cozy thing. That makes sense. Yeah, Lolly is also cold a lot. <laughs> That's part of why he moved to Florida, so he could be cold less. That's why my bed chiller also has a heating option. For the, like, two days of the year that being in bed is actually, like, hey. a cold thing. Yeah. You won't. Oh yeah, see that's 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 beautiful shorts weather for me, Kitty. Love that. What thirties? Well, yeah, forties, but yeah. Oh. I could have called this back a long time ago.
Hey, I have one of those. Yeah, but it felt nice though, didn't it, kitty? Yeah, I love cold weather. Yeah. I'm putting the seat warmer on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's the thing, right? Like, <clears throat> and I know, I know. I live in Florida, but like, like when it's cold, you can always put more layers on and get cozier. When it's hot, like it is in Florida, you just there's only so many layers that you can take off. Outdoor hockey and snowboarding. See, Fritz gets it. But Fritz, you're you're from where like American cold weather got invented, right? So I prefer not uh, not living in a place where the air hurts my face. Well, have you tried having a better, more resilient face? Great question. Well, yeah, that's why I perpetually had a beard for as, as soon as I could grow one. That's fair. And then for like the brief window of time that I had to go back into fast food, I had to shave my beard and I was like, oh God, the air hurts my face again. I see you prioritize the finger guns. No, I actually have it on random. But I've bought everything in order rather than jump around. Them. Ooh. Mm. Well, his face says he was born with it. Well, I mean, he could. Oh. I guess we're doing something else. Mm. I don't know what that something else is. It's not, that's, all right, good, fair point, Fritz, fair point. I'm sure it'll be fun, whatever it is. Oh, we're activating a control system. The thing you wanted to do very badly. All right, well, if that's the case, then I'm bringing two sentries for this um i'm gonna go strafing run because i actually don't like that, that works <coughs> why is your brain the way it is buddy oh if i had a nickel yeah might be making money in a very weird way <laughs> Maybe it's botulism. Okay, but like Bean and I have been talking about that a lot lately because like I know that, you know, certain things that could otherwise be harmful can have medical applications, see penicillin, but like for cosmetic reasons, inserting an actual, like a, a literal neurotoxin into your face is like, I just, it wouldn't be me, you know, like. It couldn't be me. Oh. Ooh, what can I make out of this? Indiscernible ooze. Love me some indiscernible ooze. What happens if I put a bunch of ooze together? I get more ooze. Ha! Nice. I ended up with an anti-material rifle anyway. <laughs> Yay. What if instead of ooze, you got Oz? 
Oh, you know what I need more of? I need more explodey potions. I should actually go make some of those before I wander off. I guess I could just go home, because I need to go home at some point soon. Get you and your little dog too. It's gonna be indiscernible ooze. Oh no, it's a minor protective draft. Well, that's nice. I'm learning potions. Yeah. Confetti bomb. Red dye, blue dye, and a feather? I could do that. Uh, you still see my... Huh? No, L4? it's not over there. Right, next battery. We got the trail to Oregon by All right. You You ever just joop? I did once. It was great. Found a sample. Ooh, love a sample. Like one of them grocery store samples? Um, sort of, except not at all like that. Oh. In any conceivable way. Oh, neat. Um, yeah. See if they have some of those, uh, see if they have some of, like, the little pizza rolls. Um, even if they do, I'm going to say they didn't. Oh. Is it because you're going to eat them because you're... No, a, a, that's ridiculous. A big meanie face? Whoa! Oh God. Uh, apparently... So I might have shot you in the back. You absolutely did, but I understand exactly why you did. <laughs> I love and the amount. I might have been blown up by our other teammate. I love the the amount of friendly fire that's in this game. The audience picks the character names at every show. There's a fair bit of improv. Ooh, I like a good improv. In so... Tom's defense, they literally just popped in in front of me, like. They didn't even do their spawn in animation. They just when suddenly bugs. It's natural reaction. I shot at them. Hmm, that'll happen. Yeah. It will happen. Means wrong brings good fortune in battles. Witches who eat children. Neat. Hopefully, somebody grabbed the samples. Uh, they were not there when I went to pick up my anti-material guns, so All right, well, I can fair. only assume yes. Hi there, Barry. There was like likes. five of them. Uh, I'm loving this game. It's it's so fun. It's it's really fun. It's really cute. Like I I'm loving everything about it so far. <gasps> Thank you, Kitty. Love you, Kitty. Good night, Kitty. See you later. Hi, Kitty. Thanks. Mistakes never trying for this game for Rumpel Stiltskin is my name. Hey there, fella. Listen, I don't know how to, how to be the one to tell you this, but I'm gonna get you. But Barry, how are you? I hope you're doing well. Good to see ya. Deep. 
That's a sentry. <laughs> I know, but it wasn't facing me, and then suddenly it was. <laughs> Dude. I'm doing pretty good. Uh, we actually had the developer here with us earlier this evening. Um, she had to dip out a little while ago, but we got to hang out for a little bit and she talked about the game and just kind of a little bit of her journey with making it and it was it was a really, really fun time. Ooh, another card. A massive one-legged bird. Looks like a giant flamingo. Creative people are, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, she did an excellent job with this. Here when bile titans aren't just popping up two at a time. Yes, I don't think we see those for another few levels. Anything else in here? I don't think so. I also enjoyed that my uh, my demo progress carried over. So if you do get the demo, no worries. Play through it, see how much you enjoy it, and if you end up getting the full game. Your progress carries over. Uh, I I found that out when I started playing tonight. Yeah, it's, it's pretty great. I did do some cool stuff. Oh, that had to have been my sentry over at the other site. I just got a Chivo for killing a target at a distance of greater than 100 meters, but I have a shotgun, so... Meanwhile, That's not the... shotgun behavior. <laughs> Meanwhile, the, the boys are playing Helldivers 2. For democracy. Democracy is not going to spread itself. Yeah. Giggity. Ooh, and I cannot stress this enough. Woo. Just a feeling. Here's the straw. Outstanding. Okay. Alright. So I got my golden straw. I've got my fairy dust. Now I need to go to the tundra and get a willow branch. Yeah, no, there's no shotguns in this particular game. The boys the boys are spreading democracy from Super Earth. <laughs> Can you imagine that? <laughs> Look oh. at this potion I crafted up. It's all of a sudden, a shotgun. <laughs> God. Uh, all of a sudden, four hell pods just drop in around you. <laughs> How many cards am I up to? Two golds, five silvers, and twelve bronze. Not bad. All right, let's keep on trucking. Um, I haven't explored the tundra yet, so let's just go here and see what's up. Oh, hey, as it turns out, it's cold up here. You need my help? Okay. Democracy ain't gonna spread itself? Yes, exactly that, Liz. Package of the willow tree. Helio, stop being, stop being a cat. But continue being a cat. I'm trying to find those offerings tempting. Okay. Hi, little buddy. Oh, little buddy. You just a little buddy. You ever had a little buddy? Lolly's got a couple little buddies in his house. <laughs> and 
democracy than shotgun it like you would a beer. That's true, you could. Oh. Oh, I don't like you. I don't like you. Here we go, Let's... boys! Hey, I found a harpy feather. That's cool. Uh, listen. Uh, no offense, but every offense. Yeah. Is that eggs? Harpy talons? Harpy. Aha! Drops a harpy egg. Wishing for that shotgun now. Listen. I mean, it wouldn't. It wouldn't necessarily hurt. Hey, little buddy. <laughs> He's a little buddy. I think we all were just like, let's call it orbitals over there for fun. <laughs> <laughs> like, fuck that area in particular. <laughs> no, thank you, Harpy. Goodbye. Okay. On the rock. An offering? A couple of hairs on my microphone. Holy shit. We left a lot of carcasses over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. Alright, cool. Hey. I got uh I got all the stuff that I need. Holy crap, that's all the stuff. Bird, how many times do I have to tell you? Yeah, eat it, bird. Uh, what else we got up here? More of this. Oh, that was good. He, he fell down. Well, uh, that sounds like um, not my problem. Oh, shit. I'm out of fucking fire potions again. <laughs> nice, Barry. Uh, actually, I wonder if the explosion potion will do anything here. No, I need something fiery. Oh, hi, little buddy. Thanks, little buddy. This game has no right to be this fun. It's so good. Yeah. I'm Pikachu to help me with that bird, right? And, well, I don't know. It, listen, we don't know. It it might not be... Ooh. Ooh. It might not be weak to uh, electric types. We just don't know. Fritz will never know. How would you know? <laughs> that Pikachu could also electrocute everything in the general vicinity including you and put you into a 20 year coma where you are eternally a 10 year old kid until you become the very best like no one ever was. Boy howdy this... the internet's a weird place isn't it? <laughs> oh look it wasn't me that killed you Hi Warder I have no friendly fire damage Oh, wait, but I have an accidental. Uh, you, you have an accidental, though. Yeah, I don't think you... How is that possible? <laughs> I don't know. It, it definitely said that you were the one that killed me. Oh. All right. Well, I don't know. New difficulty unlocked. The game's really good. Like, I'm, I'm really digging it. Uh, we had the dev here earlier. That was a lot of fun hanging out with her. Talking shop and things like that. It was just a great time all around.
Um. Ow. I don't think I want the minefield. That doesn't sound useful to me. It is not great. Well, like, this is a game where you are supposed to be constantly moving. Tommy's it a is minefield. It's very, true. it's very good when like you have to defend a point for some of these objectives, which is happens a lot. Because like, unlike it doesn't event, they don't eventually despawn. So like, once you set them, they're there. Mm. So they they are useful, but it's like we're going in three men. They're situationally useful. Oh, good, another swarmer. Um, what's this gonna give me? A furiously magical fire. Ooh. Yeah, that's great. I want all that. <gasps> Look, it's bright. Yeah, Tom is a danger magnet. Mm -hmm. For <laughs> great democracy. For great what? democracy. This is just racking up kills, right? This one? I, I think so. I don't remember. Yeah. No, I think it's one is, we're just we're we're just defending the pad again. Yeah, we can like drop all three because I saw that you took a turret too. Yeah, we can just drop those and then just AFK for like the first half of this. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I brought you all the ingredients. Oh my god! I fucking hate this kid. Is there a child in the cage? There's a child in the cage because the child was being a little shit and Baba Yaga was having none of it. So you like Baba Yaga? Well, because Baba Yaga told the little shit kid to stop being a little shit. And because you've uh, shown your, your joy of child slavery in video games. Listen here. We do what we must yeah, because hey. we can. <laughs> Speaking of which, where's Ali Beth's button? Oh, I don't think there is one. That's so weird. Well, I know. That's why I'm asking where it is. Oh yeah, I don't, I don't think I don't think that. I, mm, mm, that's mm, mm, eh. mm. Where's oh? Ah, Papa Yaga was gonna eat the kid. Oh, that's weird, Ali Beth. It doesn't it doesn't. Do it. That's weird. Yeah, you're welcome, you shit. Uh, uh, hey. Whoa, where'd all these come from? Why are there so many? Oh, uh, they came from your button. I was eliminated. Mm. Almost instantly. Have you checked your yeah. It's like she knew. It's like she knew. Oh, what did all this give me? Greater mud potion. Uh, behind you. Oh, so we can just have chargers now. All right. The sweet, sweet I did cakes. I not prepare for that. Mmm. Listen. Oh no. Oh no. We love us oh, some no. cakes. It's fine. It's just a flesh wound. Listen, Batsy. I was killed by my own turret. M bitches gotta eat, right, Batsy? I hate my life right now. Now let's go home. Let's talk to Granny. Room and even a familiar. Wonderful. That's <laughs> that would be me. Bobby asked me, asked me to make your most powerful potion. 
that well. The recipe is simple enough. You just need to combine spider silk with thyme and a feather. God, I'm terrible at this. Oh, I have one of those. Well, I wouldn't trust anything with more than two legs. That's... Wait, is that another one? Yes. Don't trust anything with more than four legs. <laughs> the radish to make kimchi. Ooh. Ooh. Toasty and I have oh carrot cake God. flavored kettle OMS corn. just joined us. Oh my god, did he really? Nice. Yeah. Is that game worth 10 years of coding? Uh, I would say so. Uh, considering it was a passion project and it's something that she did on the side for 10 years, yeah, I would say so. Welcome in, Capital QC. I'm having a great time with it. Now, what is this? Uh... Hey, gotta go by magical cleaner thank you Batsy actually even the most stubborn stains and cobwebs works like a magic because well it is that fucking hurt the locals use it for practically everything chimney <laughs> floors crockery just don't use it on your laundry it seems to make clothing disappear eh a recipe for something more useful, like banishing demons, or granting vision in the dark, or calling down a storm of lightning. All in good time, my dear. I can assure you, this is the potion Baba Yaga requested you learn. Yeah, man, let's go. Yeah, yeah, didn't know where else to go. Oh, God, John Muffet. John, what have you done? Oh, no. You can't charge me up here, you giant bitch. Oh, I know what's... Can. Fuck! Oh, I know what's happening. John Muffet's daughter has gotten taken by a spider. She was she was taken while eating her curds and whey. Well. In the deep dark forest. All right, let's go. We're gonna we're gonna do that. Actually, I need more stuff. Hey, I finished getting you this stuff. I'm not saying I left a charger alive up there. <laughs> I'm not, not saying it. Furiously magical sandstorm. Ooh. Holy <laughs> shit, he just orbitally struck that That's the furiously magical sandstorm. Jesus Christ, you two. That was just like carrot cake? Ooh. You can pet the cat, for God's sake. And he purrs. I was killed by Harry S. Truman. So. <laughs> uh, obviously, you, you weren't yeah. democracy hard enough. It really is ever. It's just so nice. <laughs> uh... <laughs> what? I stepped out. Like, my pod landed, and then I was immediately killed by me. Oh, well, you should not do well, that. Well, to be fair, you had it coming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I didn't even get a chance to move. <laughs> you know what you did, Tom. White chocolate drizzled kettle corn. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Oh, no. How are you supposed to kill these? Um, some, with something that can pierce armor. Oh, I, great! I didn't. I didn't think oh, we would. Oh God! Why are there so many of them? <laughs> because Boy. I don't know how we that we've actually been able to kill them. Because I didn't bring anything that can do armor piercing. Oh well, how about if a shuttle lands on them? Get me out of here! <laughs> My gosh! <laughs> the boys are having a time right now. That's fantastic.
There's no way I should be given any XP for this. These are, these are briefly immune to all damage. I think I'm going to put this down at the end. Explosion potion. I'll leave oh, there. Oh! He went up to level 4. But I didn't know he did that. So that's what happened. Oh! Yeah, so... um, Like, orbital strikes and um, some of the heavier support weapons can rip off armor mm. and you need to do something like that you can hit it in the butt but it's not um like even the top of his butt's armored you gotta you gotta well, find okay. i'm thick... never getting above him he's fucking a skyscraper right you gotta get like under that thick cheek and that's that's the soft gooey part <laughs> Well, that's a sentence you've said. That's one of the sentences of all time. <laughs> From one of the mods of all time. Can I, like, blow this, like, fog away? Amazing. No, it doesn't look like I can. I was say, I think the only weapon that can kill them that doesn't blow off armor, too, is uh, the Arc Thrower. Listen, Mushroom Guy, I'm very busy. I'm sorry, I have lots of things to do that are not... I assume now we're doing the uh, other level 4 mission. Yeah. 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 Snarf, snarf. Uh... This is what, control system? Yep. Oh, yeah, this is really cozy. Uh, the... Mm. Oh, my bad. That's what happened. I done hit a button. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm stuck. Oh, no. This is not good. Oh, God. I was... I was petrified. At first, I was afraid. I was petrified. If at first you don't succeed, dive, dive again. And again. And again. Again. And 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 again. I assume training manual tip for this loading screen. I was about to say. I assume that's flavor text. Pay attention to these tips. They've been carefully calibrated to ensure your success. This is, uh, it's like I wrote these. It, it is like you wrote these. You also get to choose where your teammates respawn at because you're, yeah. they're re you're reinforcing them, right? So you choose where their drop pod falls. You can absolutely just throw them into the middle of everything if you really wanted to. It's true. Well, that feels like a great way to get kicked out. I mean, uh, you do take you do deal damage to things on your way down. So, if you want to try and convince yeah. them to land on a big thing, you could probably do that to OMS. He wouldn't mind. He probably. Mr. Loaf, she's a baby. Oh, shit. Oh, that doesn't oh, work. Oh, oh, shit. Oh god, he called it an orbital. <laughs> <laughs> huh. Hmm. 
Ah. Uh. Ooh, some more of that fruit. By the way, pro tip, if you come into my stream and attempt to actually be a shit, like not kidding around, like just you attempt to just be a little shit ass troll, we have no time for that around here. Just so Or he'll make knows. you a mod, one of the two. No no, no no. I mean no, no, like we're an... a different breed of troll. Yeah, you're different. I'm just noting. Wow. If you're Italian and you're a little shit, you might be able to be a mod on this channel. Just saying. What the fuck? That is an electrical field. It'll make them like they used to. Yeah, well. Them, you mean Lolly? Yeah, that's fair. Oh boy, this is not good. I need a cauldron. Badly. No, 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 Tom Whee! and Lolly. I have not checked my butt, but thank you for asking. You're welcome. What about your butt? Ah. Oh god. I'm heading to another battery, because... Well, yeah, that's what I thought we were supposed to be doing. I was like, no one was moving, so I'm just heading to another battery. I have to come in. Not that that's going to be much help, but Fire I'm coming fangs. with you. Alright. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Uh, listen, I'm running out of stuff. Would love to have a fucking uh, cauldron. All right, I'm gonna have to go home. I, don't, I can't do anything where I am now. We'll come back to this area. Well, that was close. Nah. That was closer than I had planned. Yeah, it worked out all right. Mm. Oh, this thing's half charged before I actually realized that we were that we had pushed the button. Yeah. I thought the button was on the other side, and so I thought we were just fighting through shit. I pushed both buttons so far, I and think. Explode. Oh, no, that's indiscernible ooze. Great. Great. Oh, it didn't work.
Is it this side? Uh, it's the right side. It'll work. Oh, all right. Yeah, I can take that. That's I can. Yep, yep, yep. Actually. Ah, suck my democracy turret. <laughs> Boy, those that's those are words. <laughs> Alright, we're we're gonna go. <clears throat> you got another thing for me? Do a spider fang while I'm out? Oh bro, I just had a spider fang like five seconds ago. Water crystals? Man, you people are needy. Fucking, what is this, Pokemon? Sending a 12-year-old out for tasks Get the fuck that you, off could, my tower. you could do yourself? What just happened? What? Why did I just fall down for no reason? Uh... Tripping? Maybe. Did Tom? Did you oof when you should have whooshed? That happens to oh, me no sometimes. Idea. Oh, oh, that's why he called out an orbital. Okay. I'm gonna leave him do that. <laughs> he's got to mess with him. So no, he's got you with him. I've got to mess with me. <laughs> Ole! Ha <laughs> ha, motherfucker! Ole? Like oil of Ole? Sort of. Oh, I mean, that ice? was No, 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 no. They're, they're water crystals. It's different, weirdly enough. So I dove out of the way at the same time the orbital strike hit him and the fucker landed on me. That's unfortunate. That was, yeah, that was the word I used for it. Alright, throwing my sentries really fucking far away from the thing this time. I hate that that didn't do more. It's a Tuffet specifically. Hey, look at that. Who called it? Who called it? Come on! Alright, I got a spider fang. Good. I need that. Son of a- I forgot to equip the damn potion. Got it. Okay. There's a raw water crystal. See? Water crystal. Okay. Well, I meant to read that, but I didn't. Okay, let's make like a hockey player and get the puck out of here. Nah. That's a pun, you see. What if you're in your own offensive zone? Tom, please. Well, you want to keep the puck in.
That's how you hockey. Okay, Happy Gilmore. Not all of us, not all of us are analyzing the puns. This is Hockey 101. You're Hockey 101. How dare you? I just said what I said. All right. I Ooh. said what I said. Needed more ash. And this where we need to go down here? Uh. Yes. No. Wait. You're heading towards something. Oh, yeah, extraction, I thought. Let's go back. Alright, I got the stuff. Let's head back now that I got the stuff. Oh, yeah, okay. Smoke bomb. It gets in your eyes. Nice. A new recipe, cone of acid. Ooh, I th wait, don't I have cone of acid? I th maybe I have minor cone of acid. Uh, I need to make more stuff while I'm here. Most about hockey than you'll ever know. Look at this guy. Look at this guy thinking he knows about hockey ball. Look at this guy. Alright, I need to put the magical cleaner up there. Oh no! Huh. <laughs> Easily removes the smell of teen spirit. Nice. I'll do that. Do that. Good. I refuse to believe that there's no one coming. Oh, yep. Mm, I'll make ten. What do the spores make? Ooh, neat. Oof. Indiscernible ooze. Protective draft. Wow. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, I gotta go here. Mess hugged me before we got the pelican. <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice, good, good guy. OMS, he's had a long day. <laughs> Boy, howdy, he's had more long days than not lately, honestly. Yeah, democracy. Hey, we've served more democracy, you see. Oh, have you? Yes. Well, congratulations. A heap and helping, as it were. Ooh, I love a heap and helping, especially of like a casserole or something. Mm, we did. Yeah. Mm. We did some outstanding patriotism. Oh, good, good. Man, now Why? I want a casserole. You leveled up. Ooh. 
14? Is that... I don't... Is that enough for... If that's enough for the arc rifle, I'm... The arc cannon, I'm gonna be very happy. Hey, I think I'm about to have a boss fight. And... Hey, yeah. I'm about to have a boss oh. fight. Oh my well, I like that. god. I don't like that very much at all. <laughs> wow, you and OMS just teaming up on the finger guns there, huh? <laughs> I mean, finger guns are great. What can I say? Magical connection. And I'm back on my own ship. Me too. Oh, the host left. Ah, well, we only got 20 minutes left, so that's probably a good stopping point anyway. Yeah, that probably works. Come here, little buddy. Oh, one there more level go. and I get the arc thrower. I wish to throw arcs, you see. Ooh, I have some options now. I can get the anti-tank. Okay. okay hold on. I can get the anti-material rifle. Stalwart. Mm. There's the, the anti-tank. The orbital airburst strike. The 120 barrage. Okay, little guys. Eagle airstrike. Oh. Eagle cluster bomb. Napalm. Here comes a big one. Orbital gas. <laughs> <laughs> Supply pack. Laser cannon. Gatling sentry. That's it. Uh, do you want do? Um, recommendations? Uh, yeah, sure. Um, Napalm oh. is really good on the bugs. The cluster bomb, I believe, will let you, like, take out nests and stuff without having to throw a grenade. Oh. Um, the darkness. The, the darkness. And then... Oh, let's get her home. All right. Hey, look at that. Anti-tank is good just all around because that thing that can... That's one of the well, things that can fuck with chargers. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I might need something... And with some back chargers. Rest. So I think I'm gonna go with anti-tank. Yeah, I like anti-material, but it's just a sniper rifle. It's mm. it can armor oh. pierce, but it doesn't do it for chargers. So I still eh. feel like this is the game for armor piercing. Something's fishy or, uh, and sorry, in a good way. Sniper rifles. That's not good. Take some time to experiment huh? with you. What if something was fishy in a good way? Hmm, like a catfish dinner or something? I mean, Miss Alibeth would be super into that. Oh, God. Bowser. Well, come on, let's go. Son of a bitch. Come here, idiot rat. Oh, I think I'll wait and get the breaker. Um... Breaker is okay. Oh my god. It was, it was one of the things that got nerfed because of all the meta people. Mm. Uh, it's a Firefox. Doesn't look open source to me. <laughs> 
just mwah. when a developer makes a game. <laughs> hey Furbag, what's the deal? My Hoshi no Tama, my Starball. I have an apples and some human took it. No notes. None whatsoever. Anything on fire? No, not until I Oh my god. Listen, Rumpel still skin. I don't have time for your shit right now. Perfect. Yes, exactly. See? Uh now. Mm, let's go up here. The apple. Right hiding down there. Is it the group chat? And... Yeah. Of course it is. Also, did you know what Krakow's doing tomorrow? What is Krakow doing tomorrow, Tom? They are, or he is, I should say, building and then stunting a uh, model forklift. Jesus Christ. On stream. If you want to see Earth's most perfect chaos. Frog ass motherfucker. That's my Krakow button. It has a thing of me saying frog ass motherfucker. Prince Charming? Oh, that fucking asshole. God, I hate him. that guy. Oh, yeah. Are you in the tavern, you fucking dick? And... Hmm... Problem for me first. You be my bride slumbering deep in the fairy forest. Fuck's sake! a broom and you don't have to walk everywhere that i do like i do enjoy just whooshing about on my broom
Why would I do this to myself? That's a Toy Story comment. No, I decided to do a sneaky quick hand of Bellatro. And it's just immediately hmm. RNGing me. You know, Bellatro always has the last laugh. I mean, fine, but can I have, like, one laugh? No, you may not have any laughs. No laughs for Literally. you. Baskin Robbins always finds out. Baskin Robbins don't play. spread democracy. I do. <laughs> Remember when you and Lockhart were spreading democracy and OMS showed up to help? Yeah. He's very good at spreading democracy. He is, it's true. He might be the most patriotic of us all. Too. Oof. I am very bad at spreading democracy. Mm. But that's okay, because it's fun. Ah, no, I don't want either of those things. Okay, there's supposed to be a woman sleeping in the forest somewhere. And those damn fairies. Uh, is she in the cave, perhaps? No, this is the one that I've already been in. Yeah, I've been to this cave. Stop hitting me. No. Okay, I guess I'm just going to keep working my way backwards. You could work your way downtown. No. I mean, you could. I mean, I could, but do I really want to? Oh my well, god. You can answer that. Is that... Is that fucking... Dead broad off the table? Ingredients. A salamander skin and water crystals. And it's all over the Firelands. Oh boy. Piercing iron shaft. Hole punch. Fuck you, snake. Hey, snake. Oh, it's a snake. Oh. Well, well, well. Hey. Come here. Come on. You want to come over here?
Get wrecked, fool. Let's go. Oh, and your friend, too. I'm going to break this rock. Okay. I got to go find more dwarves. Hmm. I know they have that song about going off to work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and they always greet the hose. I'm not sure that that's the... That you know? Sure, sure. It's the name of the song. I don't... I... See you later, new Doug. <laughs> Do we have enough dwarfs? Does anyone ever? I mean, that's fair. Piss off, ghost! <laughs> it's freaking gone. Another day, another Doug. <laughs> oh, here we go. Good movie that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Prepare yourself. You are about to meet the Grand Master. Ooh. 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 King is full of aces. I'll take that. Oh, that didn't matter at all. Okay, this run's pretty much over. This game... This game becomes fucking ruthless when you start going up into the higher chip levels. Ow. Follow me. Take the bait. Are you serious? Seems like they might be serious. Tusk. Hey, you got bonked on the head, big idiot. Don't bonk him on the head with it. Get rotated, idiot.
Well, all right, I guess I got that one. Finally beat the blue deck in Bellatro yesterday? Nice. Nice, Amy. Hi. I don't ask how are you, but apparently you're doing pretty good. I th the blue deck was the o was one of the two that I didn't have as much trouble with. The rest the of them have been taking turns stomping my balls into my throat. And yet, I'm still playing this goddamn game. Listen, whatever. Listen, Amy. Whatever you gotta do. Well, however you gotta get it done. Yeah. No, I. It, I don't blame you one bit. It gets absolutely ruthless. It is. Yeah, it's really good. Okay, that works. Alright, let's head out of here. I might have time to get it. Eh, I mean, the, the buzzer's about to go off, but... I can at least go to Fire Mountain and see what's going on out here. Probably fire. Oh, that's a... That's just a... That's a guess. Good call, good call. Yeah, that's a salamander. Oh, got some skin. Got some eyes. All right. There we go. You know what? That worked out. I'm gonna go uh, take the stuff to Snow White real quick and get this all squared away. Snow White. Snow White. That's better than her less hygienic sister, Snow Yellow. Yikes. <laughs> oh, didn't mean to do that. Up here. Yeah. Okay. God. Hasn't even met her. You, you, bitch, you didn't do shit. Undignified? Your face is undignified. That's pure. Get the fuck out. Good. Uh, hey, what? Oh, lions. That's. That sounds like a sphinx. Alright, well, we're gonna let the crops burn tonight. <laughs> and then we'll come back to them in the morning. No, we'll come back to this on Thursday. Uh. Well, I'm having just a great time with this. Uh, I'm having a great time with this. Uh, thank you again. I know I've said it before, but thank you again to 
uh, Renee, the developer, for both the key, for hanging out with us at the beginning of stream tonight. It was a great, great time. If you didn't get a chance to catch that, go back and watch the VOD. She's here with us for the first hour of stream. And she talks about the game and the process of building it and shows us some fun stuff in the game, too. It's It was a really great time. I really enjoyed having her. Um, so it was that was really, really good. Uh, let's see. What else? Um, yeah, I'm playing this all week. Playing this all week. And uh, I may... Uh, we'll see what I'm doing next week. But this week I'm doing this. Uh, no Firebot Friday stream this Friday. Uh, I have a meeting, so i got to do that. Uh, but uh, that's pretty much it. Yeah, this is what we're doing this week. Um, okay, let's get out of here. Uh, who's doing what? I'm certain that someone is doing something somewhere. That's true. These are these are probably things that are happening. Yes. Um. Why is he awake? Zara. <laughs> yep. His backpack, but this might be my fault. Oh, is this your fault? Okay. I, I might have teased him for most of his stream. A Final Fantasy today that he wasn't playing backpack battles. <laughs> oh, I see. So, so he's making up for it by being up entirely too late and playing backpack battles. I mean, nobody told him to do that. <laughs> no, no one told him to do that. But you know, it's Zara, so he's gonna do it anyway, as he is wont to do. Uh, all right, we're gonna go see Zara um, and hang out with him while he's playing some backpack battles. Uh, thank you all again. Um, I will see you on Tuesday for more po or Thursday for more more of potions. Um, until then, as always, please remember: be good to yourselves, be good to each other, and I'll see you soon. Bye. That's